Hello, this Happy Fox Help Desk demo will talk about the use of priorities. Now, priorities are used to indicate the importance or urgency of a particular ticket. Your users will be able to go into a ticket and change the priority if they are given that level of access. It's very simple to go in there and make ticket changes on the fly. If you have access to it, you're able to change them directly here from the main screen. But I want to go more into how they are built, what goes into them, what you can do to change them, and ultimately what you can do to automate them. So the best way to go in there to start discovering priorities is to go into the menu, go over to the Manage section, and scroll down to the section that is about priorities. Now in this section, you will see what our system defaults to, which is low, medium, high, and critical. You are definitely able to add your own priorities. You can add a brand new priority, such as something called Extreme. Or you're able to go in there and just say modify one of these for use by say one of your own departments such as critical and then maybe your uh, software as a service team uses it. So you're able to go in there and just modify a label but that becomes its own uh, priority in here which perhaps a different team can then use. Now you are very much able to go into each priority. You can edit an existing one or edit one that you make yourself. You can also delete something if you decide it's not relevant for you and that you don't need it anymore. You're also able to add descriptions for each priority and also create a help text on that little eye right there that'll pop up, giving agents a good idea about what the priority is to be used for once they're inside the actual agent console. So what I want to do is also show that you're able to drag and drop priority levels around in here. You're, you're not, uh, you know, if you want to change the order of things, you can definitely do that inside of here. And then your changes will be saved. And then when people are using these inside the agent console, this is the order in which they will exist. So let's go back over there to take a look at that and work exactly how Happy Fox handles priorities inside a ticket itself. Going inside the ticket, and I'm able to go inside and change it to low, medium, high, or critical. If I change something to medium in the system, notice how that's listed here in the audit trail. And if I decide later on to upgrade it to critical, hey, there it is in big bold letters. And that has also been added into the audit trail as well. Actually, the most interesting thing about this particular section is the ability to go in and build automation based off of priorities. So I can go in and create a smart rule and I can set a priority based off of certain things happening. A good example of this would be that, let's say I would want the priority to automatically be established as critical if a particular email came in and the subject line contained urgent. I can now add that, set this live, and I would name it something like urgent critical rule. So now anytime an email arrived and the subject line contained the word urgent, it would automatically elevate the priority level to critical. You're also able to use smart rules where the priority is actually used to help make an assignment in the system. So for instance, if I wanted to say that my colleague, Jason, is to be assigned all priorities that reach a certain level, I'm able to actually go into the system and pull that information out right here. Priority is critical. Add that to here. If I set that live, that would be the Jason assignment rule. This would automatically assign a ticket to Jason if the priority is set as critical. This is how you use the Smart Rules section of Happy Fox. I hope that this has been useful. Uh, please refer back to the uh, Happy Fox University or our help desk area for more information. Thank you.